And why I think that the better starting premise to think of is to think of your brain as like a scientist is really both intended as a kind of insult and a compliment in the sense that I think that it makes you think that you don't need to consider there being lots of different kinds of processes in your mind. It could be that your mind and brain are kind of, it's always in the game of doing the same thing. It's trying to make a theory to make the world make sense. And through that fundamentally very rational process, you can nonetheless get caught with paradigms and theories that don't actually fit the way reality works. And I think it's a good model to how science really works, right? Because as, as any scientist will tell you, and I say this as a scientist myself, science might be the sort of best way that we've come up with to understand the world that we live in, but it's not by any means infallible. The kind of history of science is the history of people who tried really, really hard to make sense of the world around them and nonetheless ended up with theories that didn't quite fit the way things worked.